It's time to ball, y'all. I'm Stuart Scott, and it is almost time to do the thing. Clyde the Glide is going to show us what real speed is all about. Yo, don't bat an eye, ever, or you just might miss this guy blowing by for a layup while the defender is just standing there like he's doing the robot. He's got quicks like you won't believe. You better recognize. Eighties West. Coming up next. Welcome aboard, Hoop fans. We're here at the Legends Arena in Springfield. The visiting Eighties Eastern All Stars will square off against the Eighties Western All Stars here on the NBA on ESPN. Hello, everybody. I'm Bob Fitzgerald here with Bill Walton and Michelle Tafoya will join us later. Bill, as we take a look at both teams, what do you think will be the keys to victory? Well, basketball is definitely a team game, but you can't win it all without great players. Clyde Drexler is, in my mind, the premier shooting guard in the entire NBA. He has that knack for making the right decision offensively. When he's on, he can manipulate defenders like puppets. And on the other side is another guy who can certainly take over this game. Moses Malone easily ranks among the very best centers in the whole league. I just love to watch him play. He is such an impressive scorer down low. And once he gets it in the post, he cannot be denied. Thank you, Bill. We're just about ready for the tip to get this one started. Control the tip off and we'll get this one started. Now let's go down to Michelle Tafoya who has an update for us. Michelle? Thanks, Bob. I spoke with the 80s West Legends head coach before the teams came out and he told me that their focus is on defense. He said that's our focus today. If we can lock things down defensively, the offense will take care of itself. We'll see what happens. Bob, let's send it back to you. Thanks, Michelle. The nine-footer was off target by Abdul-Jabbar. Irving. Ripped down inside by Kareem. Here's the break. Drives to the hole. Graceful finish. That layup was right there for the taking. But as long as you don't rush it, those buckets should be automatic. The 80s East advance it, and they're behind by two. Passes to Thomas. The bounce pass to Malone. Passes to the right block. To the bucket. Can't connect. Kevin McHale has got to be upset. That one didn't fall. Anytime you get right to the rim like that, it's tough to miss. The jumper was buried by Drexler. The pass to Malone. Pass to Thomas. From just inside the arc, the offensive rebound by Malone. Connects. He drove that one right into the teeth of the defense, Fitz. I don't care how that one looked. That was not an easy layup. Passes to the baseline. With the runner. Good. A little too quick on the trigger there, especially when you're being guarded as well as he was. But you can't argue with the results. The bird. Skip pass to Thomas. Pulls the trigger. Nails the turnaround jumper. The inbound to Johnson. They bring it up court. Coming up on the three minute mark here in the first. Gives the up fake. Johnson. Yes. We can't let that one go by without taking another look. When the opportunity presents itself, you have to take advantage. They bring it up court. 249 left in the first. Bounces it to Bird. Passes to Thomas. From just inside the arc, Johnson rips it down. Isaiah Thomas got just the kind of look he was hoping for. Sometimes they just don't fall for you, though. Pass to Johnson. The skip pass to Worthy. Pass cross court. 
Irving reeled in the defensive board. To McHale. Throws the shot out of this area code. Worthy stole that one away. And break is on. Plays it right in. The 80s East advance it, and we have a six-point game. The pass to Bird. From downtown. Johnson holds it in off the defensive glass. Very Bird had a real decent look there from long range, but couldn't make the most of it. That's his range, though, and he won't be deterred. Six it. The name of the game is finishing off the play, Fitz. That wasn't an easy layup by any stretch of the imagination, and he had to earn what he got that time. Nice job of going to the rack and laying it in there. Swings it to Worthy. Passes to Drexler. Pump fakes. Shoots it. Great feed by the 15-year veteran out of Houston. Dishes it to Bird. Tries to back down. With the hook shot, it's ripped down by Drexler. The defense hit the tone there on the inside of his nice stop. Drops in the pretty lane. He was working so hard to take it to the hole that time. Fits the spin move, set it up beautifully. The 80s East bring it up court, and they're trailing by eight. Thomas. Clanks it off back iron. They're running. Pass to Drexler. Spins. Takes it in. Fouled hard, and he'll take a trip to the line. And it's good. It and they'll try to stop the run. Skips it to McHale. 13 feet out. Puts too much on it. Kevin McHale could have definitely found himself an easier shot than that. That's one of those where you're stunned if it goes in. Malone cuts off the pass. Tries the spin move. Shoots from the post. Worthy rips it down inside. Passes to Drexler from long range. Nails it. Inbound pass to Thomas. We're at the end of one, and it's already a double-digit lead. The score, 19 to 6. to start the second quarter. Pass to Bird. Launches beyond the arc. Money! To Worthy. Feeds it to the middle. Let's it go. Pass to Bird. The pass to Malone. Crosses it over. Floats it up. Doesn't get enough under it. They've been dominating the boards, and that's a major reason why they hold this sizable lead. It's all about denying the other team second chance opportunities, and of course, creating them yourself on the offensive glass. Passes to Malone. Pass to Thomas. Takes the three. 
Bird grabs the offensive rebound. Tipped up and in. Watch him fight for position and make the play on this one, kids. Great job. The 80s West working up court. They're shooting 83% from the floor. To Worthy. The pass to Abdul Jabbar. McHale grabs the rebound. Dunks it home. Nice little play there. Not the fanciest dunk in the world, but it got the job done. The 80s East working up court to shooting 25% from beyond the arc. Passes to the baseline. Bird. Ripped down inside by Bird. Misses it again. Passes to the left block. Backs down. Hook that post shot by Drexler. From five slamming Janet in the early 1990s to Dream Team member in 1992 and NBA World Champion in 1995, Clyde Drexler made his mark on the game of basketball. It's hard to think about Clyde the Glide on the court without envisioning him holding the basketball high over his head and gliding into one of the trademark throwdown slams. This guy was pure theater on the court. Seven on the shot clock. Passes to Abdul Jabbar from the corner. Sweet rebound by the 13 year veteran of Minnesota. Gets airborne. Hammer! And he'll go to the line. He can't get the first. He sinks the second. Inbound pass to Johnson. Johnson advances it. He's got 10 points. Bounce pass to Chambers. From deep three-point range. Snatched down from way up high by Malone. Here's the break. Feeds it to McHale. It's good. He really came through on this play. You can see how he got into perfect position to score the second time around in the replay. The 80s West working up court, and they lead by 13. The dish to Worthy. Tries to post him up. Malone pulled down another rebound. That's four so far. James Worthy is a potent scorer inside, but you've got to hand it to the defense. They put the pressure on him, and the shot was off the mark. Swings it to Worthy. Dishes down low. Changes the shot. Graceful finish. Skip pass to Bird. From 17 feet out. Good. Feeds it down low. To the bucket. Finishes with a soft touch. Sometimes you just have to force things to create your own offense. He did a nice job of going inside to make something out of nothing. The 80s East working up court, and they're trailing 31 to 18. Pass to Bird. The feed to McHale. Magic dabs the ball. The fast break. The loads. Automatic. Now that's the way to finish at the rack. But so many players today will miss those wide open lands. It all boils down to concentration, just like he showed. The 80s East work it up court. They're shooting 33% from the floor. To Irving. Dumps it inside. McHale. Abdul Jabbar snags his fifth rebound of the game. Kevin McHale went up strong in the lane, but with that defensive pressure, it was too tough a shot to make. Nice effort, though. The pass to Chambers. Malone ripped it down inside. They'll probably hold for the last shot. Passes to the right side. 
Passes to Irving. Launches beyond the arc. Fired short, but gets the kind roll when it goes in. Fires up a shot from the opposite baseline. Not this time. And that concludes the first half. The score, 33 to 21. Now that we've got a little break in the action, why don't we take a look at the first half with our ESPN game track. They'll take it away. Magic Johnson has an excellent field goal percentage in the first half. He's very confident, he's found his rhythm, and he's been getting good shots. That's made him invaluable to his team. Larry Bird has been giving his all on the other side of the ball, but they're still trailing by more than a little. He and his teammates are definitely going to have to kick it into a higher gear in the second half if they're going to come back and win this thing. Thanks, Bill. Without further ado, it's time to start the third. McHale throws it in to start the third. Let's send it down to our sideline reporter, Michelle Tafoya. Michelle, what do you got? Thanks, Fitz. During halftime, I had a moment to talk with the head coach of the 80s West Legends. He said that they've done a good job of being aggressive and controlling the tempo of this game. I commented on their hot shooting, and he came back saying, quote, we're working well with one another, and we've managed to create the good looks. We'll see if the dominance continues in the second half. Back to you guys. Thank you, Michelle. Pass to Chambers. to Johnson from 17 feet out. The defensive board grabbed by McHale. It's two on one. Swatted by Johnson. Abdul-Jabbar picked his pocket. Here's the break. Get that out of here. Get back on defense. The pass to Irving. Shoots left block. Good. The steal by Thomas. On the break. Three rebounds now by Magic. That's how you play a physical game and grab those rebounds. Nice board right there. Pass to Johnson. Passes to Drexler. Gives the up fake. Seven on the shot clock. For three. Clanks it off the front of the rim. The bounce pass to Thomas. Lobs it inside. Jams it home. Inbound pass. The 80s West advance it, and they're leading 33 to 27. Pump fakes. Releases. Misses the jumper. The defense knew not to leave him open for mid-range, and they did a very good job of pressuring that shot. Bounces it to Bird. Pump fakes. Chambers. Skied for the rebound. Johnson works it up court, and he's got four assists. To Drexler. The handoff to Worthy. Skips it to Drexler. Count it. He was able to put his stamp on that one. When your number's called, that's the way you want to come through. They bring it up court. 216 left in the third. The skip pass to Bird. Passes to Thomas. Feeds it down low. Goes up. Finishes with a soft touch. The pass to Chambers. Backs him down. Drexler was hacked on the way up and only get two shots at the line. He can't take the free throw.
good on number two. The inbound to Thomas. Thomas brings it up court. He hasn't hit a shot from the floor. Passes to the baseline. McHale. It falls. He drove that one right into the teeth of the defense, Fitz. I don't care how that one looked. That was not an easy layup. Johnson works it up court, and he can pick up assist number five this trip down the floor. Swings it to Chambers. Pass to Worthy. Puts up the tray. Nice bucket by the 12-year veteran out of North Carolina. James Worthy is just an average shooter from behind the arc, but you still have to guard him. He got a good look there from downtown and said, hey, why not? Bounce pass to Irving. With the crossover. Fires. Lays it right in. Stellar move for him here, Fitz, to get into position to make the play, especially considering that's not his style with the fancy ball handling moves. The 80s West advance that they're shooting 40% from long range. Shoots from the post, bounces it off left rim, then in. Thomas heads up court, and he's got four assists. Passes to Bird. The pass to Bird. Pass to Irving. The inside runner. Scooped up by Thomas. Can't convert the layup. Automatic. He had that layup all the way. Once you get the shot you want, it's all about having the confidence and follow through to finish it off. Johnson advances it, and he's got 14 points. Passes to Abdul Jabbar. Skips it to Johnson. Malone crashed the defensive board and came up with it. They'll probably hold for the last shot. Passes to the left block. From six feet, the 80s East turn this one over out of bounds. Off target shot by Magic. We've just finished the third. The score 41 to 35. Chambers inbounds it to start the final quarter. Skip pass to Worthy. Pass cross court. Passes to the right block. From the right block, rebounded inside by Thomas. Dumps it inside. Takes it up, gets the lay in. To Drexler. Jacks up a triple, nails it. Good looking play here, but I like how he scored on this one. They bring it up court, coming up on the four minute mark here in the fourth. Passes to McHale. Passes to the baseline. Alters his release. Board number 10 grabbed by Malone. Tries to lay it in, but it doesn't go. The pass to Drexler. From short range. Gets nothing but that. He's put the team on his shoulders and carried them to this lead like only a true star can. Amazing performance fits. The 80s East advance it, and they trail by nine. Pass to Irving. Dishes it to the middle. McHale. It's ripped down by Malone. The ball's loose. They're running. Nails it. It's always a good thing to see players making plays. He saw the opening, and he took it in to score the basket. Thomas advances it. He hasn't hit a shot from the floor. 
Skips it to Malone. Passes to Thomas. To Irving. To stop the run. Bounces off the left rim and out. Credit the D for stopping that. They didn't even give him any room at all to operate, and he couldn't sink it. Gets the lead. Fires it way up court. Tries to back him down. Releases. Can't finish it in the post. The pass to Johnson. Passes to Drexler. Pass to Abdul Jabbar. Unloads from nine. Doesn't get anything. to Mikhail. Automatic. Definitely a good play here. Let's see that one from a different angle. Inbound pass to Johnson. The 80s West advance it, and they should try to use the whole shot clock here. The pass to Drexler. Pass to Abdul Jabbar. With the drop step. Spins to the middle. Yes! When you get in close like that, you have to be able to seal the deal no matter how much traffic you're in fits. That was a nice play. They bring it up court. Minute 58 left in regulation. Fires from the right block. No good, and they continue to trail by double figures. Are scrounging for points here in the fourth quarter. To Chambers. Shoots. Into the far iron, it goes in. The 80s East bring it up court and they trail 54 to 39. To the bucket, Abdul Jabbar grabs the rebound. Passes to Chambers. Jams it in. Once he got inside that time, there was no doubt about it. He was going to throw it down. Pass to McHale. Unloads from nine. Abdul Jabbar hauls it in off the defensive glass. Crosses it over. Swatted by Thomas. Finishes with a soft touch. The name of the game is finishing off the play fits. That wasn't an easy layup by any stretch of the imagination. And he had to earn what he got that time. Nice job of going to the rack and laying it in there. The 80s East missed that one, and they're still behind by double digits. Get some hang time. Fouled hard, and he'll take a trip to the line. Sinks the first of two. Sikpa will enter the game. He doesn't get off the bench that often, but they'll give him some burn here. And he splits the free throws. Packs him down. With the hook shot, no good, but they still have a double-digit lead. Dumps it to the middle. Return to sender. Sigma came up with the steal. An emphatic rejection by Byrne. Malone caught him off guard and swiped it away. Cans the shot. Drexler brings it up court, and he can pick up his 20th point this trip down the floor. The pass to English. Tries to post him up. Five on the shot clock. The skip pass to McAdoo. Shoots with the clock winding down. Money! To Irving. Irving. Awesome pass by the 13-year veteran out of Indiana. Inbound pass to Theus. Pump fakes from deep. There's the horn, and that's the end of the game. The 80s West defeat the 80s East 61-43. Both teams gave it their all, Bill. You can say that again.
The 80s West All-Stars played well today. Offensively, they were in attack mode, shooting at a high percentage, and on defense, they really hustled and contested every shot. They really put it together on both ends of the floor and earned this win. Thank you, Mr. Walton. It's now time to see the player of the game. Johnson was in top form. He finishes with 20 points, seven assists, and he's our ESPN player of the game. That about does it. For Bill Walton, Michelle Tafoy, and the whole ESPN crew, Bob Fitzgerald saying thanks for watching and take care.